here's the table. We're playing an interesting game today, Switched Army, so I'm using Steve's Witch Hunters and he's using Eldar. Um, and we're also doing a little bit different terrain here. Um, this hill, that, that, and this are 4+, plus, and all these small little sections in this whole middle of walls and blasts and everything, that's all, that's all 5+. plus. So I'm going to go ahead and get ready to roll for mission. Okay, so he's going to go roll for mission now. That's um, every mission, I believe. <laughs> Capture and control. Yeah, one objective each. And deployment is spearhead. That's interesting. Rolling for initiative. I roll a five versus a two. And I'm going to go second. Woo! Okay, here's the setup. Um, Steve shows that corner, obviously. Um, there's ten uh, wraith guard there with a warlock and a farseer. Two wraith lords with... Um, uh, scatter lasers and shirt and cannons. Warbus representing an avatar. We thought we had one with us, but we don't. Um, and two wave serpents with ten dire avengers in each. His objective is this gray knight here, and my objective is this gray knight here. Um, obviously, I'm trying to take them both since they're mine. I mean, he owns them, but I mean, I'm the witch hunters. Come on. Um, <laughs> uh, over here, I've got an exorcist and another exorcist on the hills. Fifteen sisters with. Um, a veteran with an immolator, and a cannonist with an immolator, the one with the black immolator there, um, and an inferno pistol, two melta guns, um, so that's an anti-armor squad, infantry squad, and anti-infantry with um, flamers in that rhino, anti-tank with melts in this rhino, and 15 more sisters with another cannonist with a blessed weapon, and flamer, heavy flamer in there, so going into first turn, I'm not going to steal the initiative, um, so there we go. Okay, turn one. Uh, move forward the vehicles just a little bit. Everything moved forward six inches pretty much. Um, Wraith Lord is guided and Wraith Guard are fortuned. Um, one Bright Lance got through to this with a pen. Failed my cover. Was not feeling good about that, but it can't shoot for a turn, so sucks, but better than it could have been. Um, and uh, Wraith, both Wraith Lords shot at these, killing three um, of the 16 in the squad. So going into my turn one. Okay. Um, a good but a crappy turn too. Um, shot with these guys into the Wraith Guard, did nothing. Shot with these ones, used my AP1 and actually killed two of them. I got three sixes, so he saved one cover save. Um, Exorcist got six shots. All of them hit, five of them glanced and penned this vehicle. Yeah, five of the six. Uh, and um, he saved every last one of them. So that's disappointing. Um, but at least I killed two Wraith Guard, right? So I, I guess I did more damage than I took. We'll see how this turn goes. Okay, a pretty sad turn for the Witch Hunters. Um, both of these shot, both hit, both, um, well, one glanced, one penned. I saved the glance and the pen took off my weapon, so that's worthless now. Um, over here, three of those guys are in range and they got a pen against that, but I actually saved that one. And uh, two of these guys died, but they, well, two or three of them, they'll, yeah, they, they're losing a bunch of guys. Um, but they made their leadership. And everything moved forward. Avatar ran. Okay, so this was a horrendously pitiful turn. Um, this immobilized itself. These guys all shot. Wasted a faith point. Did three wounds to him at AP1. And he saved two. So he lost one wound. Um, Exorcist moved forward because it's worthless. Um, these guys all shot into those. And did absolutely nothing. Wasting another faith. Um, Exorcist got five shots into the Wave Serpent with no cover this turn. And... Um, Three hit and absolutely no four pluses. Um, so I really pretty much am, we'll, we'll, we'll see how it goes, but I don't think I'm going to do too well. Uh, going into top of three. Okay, this round was slightly better to me. Um, Wraith Guard moved forward, shot, and killed two, which was not enough for leadership. Both Wraith Lords shot into it, getting ten total wounds, and I actually saved every last one of them, so that was, that was a relief. Um, he charged into combat, killed two bolters, and I killed two wraith guard back with the uh, cannonist eviscerator. Rum, rum. So that was fun. Um, so we're still locked in there, and uh, both lances from the wave serpents were shot into the exorcist. Um, one failed to even hit with three rolls; the other one hit, but rolled a three on the armor pen. So they're finally losing some of their effectiveness. Um, he shot in here, rolled a one to hit. So that's pretty much all that happened. Um, going into my turn three. Okay, this turn was quite a bit more productive than previous turns. Um, these guys disembarked. Rhino still didn't restart itself. Um, they shot, did nothing. Um, these guys all moved and rapid-fired into the Avatar, doing, um, well, 13 hits. 
and then I used my faith, so on a 6 it's AP1, got 0 of those. So, um, he's still alive and well with like 4 wounds left. Um, over here I disembarked and charged in the 2nd squad. I actually killed 4 of the Wraith Guard and then 1 more from them being fearless and I lost 1 guy in return. Um, one melter gun guy, so uh, they're doing pretty snazzy. And you move this up to do really nothing at all. Um, and Exorcist shot and actually took off the Bright Lances from that, so um, much more productive this turn. Um, we're going into uh, top of four. Okay, over here, um, this um, can't really do anything without its main weapon. This one moved over here and actually immobilized itself and didn't get a hit on me, or got a hit but didn't get a glance my armor or anything. Um, charged in both his Wraith Lords and his Avatar there, and I failed my Invulnerable Saiyans, which really sucked. Um, so, I failed to get Invulnerables in the large squad that was in there. I killed the Farseer and the Wraith Guard, so there's just a Warlock left there. But, um, he did five wounds, um, so I lost combat by one. And, of course, my Canonist squad with the Eviscerators, um, is falling back, and I have no faith left. So that'll be, that'll be fun to die. <laughs> um, and, uh, I guess really all I can hope is that he kills that squad and I get phased back before they uh, fall completely off the table, which is not likely. Uh, that's pretty much all that happened, so going in bottom of four. Okay, a pretty painful turn. Um, I didn't really do much. I moved these guys back a little bit. Um, I was out of faith, so I couldn't do anything there. Um, lost all but one of them from power weapons, that kind of stuff. And then the warlock with the spear does one wound against my last guy and I fail it. So now they get to run rampant again during during his turn instead of mine, so that sucks. Um, these guys are falling back, I'm up to one faith. Exorcist shot twice uh, against that, didn't do anything. And I move this, pop smoke, and move that. Um, that's pretty much it. Going to top of five, could be the last turn. Okay, um, this turn, uh, Wraith Lords, everything moved forward straight towards the guys holding my objective, shot at them, killed them with two. So they don't need to take leadership or anything. Um, this shoots over here at my side armor and doesn't do anything out of two. Um, so that's pretty much it for there. These guys tried assaulting, nothing happened. Um, we just looked up the rule. We believe these guys can use the faith to regroup um, before they fall back. Let us know if you know differently. Um, so going to bottom of five could be the last round. Okay, so this round I shot the exorcists into this one, did two wounds. He made both of his saves from the other Wraith Lord. Um, Meltus from this squad did one wound to him, charged, did one more wound, and lost one, so we tied there. Um, these guys all rapid fired into him, doing three wounds, he saved them all. This guy's contesting over there, and that was getting ready too. So, um, as it stands right now, I've got one objective uncontested, and I'm contesting another one. So if it ends here, I win, otherwise I'm probably screwed. So you want to go ahead and roll? <laughs> one or two we end? We go on. Well, there wasn't a one or two in there. Alright. Oh, a cock dice. How suspenseful. We're going on. We go on. I lost. <laughs> okay, this turn, um, not sure if it's good or bad, we'll decide later. <laughs> um, this shot into my exorcist. Um, can't shoot next turn. Um, these guys disembarked. Um, not sure if that was good or bad, we'll see what happens this round. Um, over here, he's contesting. These guys lost one more from the Wraith Lord, and then Cannon is pff, Eviscerator again, kills the last one on the Wraith Lord. Um, in combat here, Avatar charges, um, killed two of them. I used my Litanies of Faith to give them all plus two strength. I did like two normal wounds and two power weapon wounds. He took, failed one power weapon wound. So uh, he's down to two. Or he, he's taken two wounds, so he's down to, I think, three. Um, so that's that's kind of crazy in there. And uh, that's pretty much it. So going bottom of six could again be the last round. Okay. <laughs> Over here, lots of stuff happened. I made some stupid mistakes, forgot to shoot the storm bolter. So Canonist killed the war warlock with its inferno pistol. These guys shot and charged that. Um, Exorcist only did one wound to the right floor in the open field. And their Meltos did nothing. Um, so they're locked in combat, they lost one. Um, lost one here from bad rolls with the Avatar. Um, did two power weapon wounds back, I think, two or three, and he saved um, all but one, so he lost one more wound, so he's down to two, I believe, and we tied combat there. So um, over on this side, I moved this forward and went to tank shock through and immobilized myself. So that's fun. Still contesting that objective roll. Let's see if we go on, on a four plus, I believe. We We're done. Game ends. So it's a draw. All right, thanks for the game, man. Yeah, good game.